Kwa ambaye pia ni chairman ya region yetu ya Tana River Isiolo na Marsabet Honorable Raso aka aka Simba Wasaku ukitaka kujua pia zaidi ambaye atakuja kuwa governor wa Marsabit County Excellency, the Deputy President, our Governor, our brother, uh, Abdi Guyo, uh, our CS, Honorable Machogu, uh, PSS, uh, my Honorable colleagues, uh, distinguished guests, parents, uh, teachers, Board of Management, uh, students, uh, good afternoon. Good afternoon. IG, IG. IG, IG. Uh, Your Excellency, I think because of time and also this function is about raising funds, I'll be very brief. But by being br brief, I want to say as follows. It's your law girls. It's not just a girls' school. It is the alliance of Isiolo and Upper Eastern. So I want to plead with both yourself and the CS that let us make this alliance of this region. Uh, the second issue, I want to thank you, the Deputy President, and His Excellency the President, the Honorable William Ruto, for demystifying the presidency. You know, for a long time, we only see the presidents during campaigns. We see them on TV, addressing parliaments, and also in big functions. But for them to come to a rural school such as this, in the midst of their reign, or when they are running government, I think in it itself is unique. I know the president is in Western today. You are in Upper Eastern. It is indicative of your commitment to make this a great nation. So we really thank you on behalf of people of this region. I want to thank my honorable colleagues who have come from as far as Nyaruru, Nakuru, and Nandi, Lamu, and many far-flung areas. There was one time, and that was no long ago, in 2022, a young legislator stood up in Kiambu, and he said, this alliance should just be for Kiambu. And there was a serious uproar among us, especially the pastoralists. And I ask myself, what is the uproar about? Can't we make alliance wherever we are? And I think we can. And that is why we are here. So we really uh, thank you for not going to your constituencies and counties, but being with us today to raise funds for such an important occasion. There are issues of concern today. It is about housing, it is about uh, health care, and many others. For those of us who have been in Parliament long enough, we know what is good for this country. If the President and the Deputy President take up a position that is good for the future and the strategic direction of this country to make Kenya a better place, I think we are going to support it as Kenyans. We know there are issues in court, but what we want to plead with the courts is just one. Please be Kenyans and be patriotic. That is all we want to ask of you. Finally, Your Excellency, you have come to Isiolo five times. 
Now there is a county in the north that borders Sudan on one side, it borders Ethiopia. It is the farthest county to the north. It is much bigger than Isiolo, although we speak one language and we are one people. So for that reason, I beg of you that going forward, just mark in your diary that the next destination is Marsabit. Whether it is supporting women group or uh, education or any project of your choice, we also welcome you to that region. Finally, I want to thank the governor of Isiolo. I think he has shown unique leadership. Many were saying at the beginning that he and the MCA but I think it's better than those governors, even those ones who are holding doctorate or PhDs in terms of delivering services to the people of Isiolo. I want to finally thank uh, Mumina Bonaya. Mumina has invited us now five times to Isiolo, in Ngarimara, uh, in Burat, I think in many other functions, and I think she has raised a lot of money from us. So for that reason, the people of Isiolo should be proud of uh, your women representatives. I think she has done a commendable job. IG, IG. IG, IG. Sauti yenu yuko chini na tunaenda kuchanga pesa. Ebu tusalimene kwa mkono. Let me now invite the governor of Isiolo County, the Honorable Abdi Guyo.